we're about to leave. Um, I have an event to attend to for Shea Moisture, which is exciting. Um, I'm really excited. I don't know how many times I'm gonna say this. Today's outfit, I don't know. I'm like, it's Shea Moisture. Like, will I be wearing, should I like wear a gown? Like, what am I supposed to wear? So I'm like, you know what? Keep it simple, wear some heels, but don't do too much. So I'm wearing these jeans from Fashion Nova, but you can get the same jeans on Zara or whatever. I'll try to link, I get, I got, I also have the same jeans from Pretty Little Thing and they're like the same. So um, I wanted to pair, to wear my Zara pair cause the hems are ripped like at the bottom cause there's the split, right? But there's like this bleach stain. I don't know what happened and I'm not the one that does the laundry, Bay does. So I'm like, what do you do with my jeans? I remember, I wore these jeans like twice. What? Why is there a bleach stain? If it was like a nighttime event, like at the club or something, I'll still wear them because you can't really see like the bleach thing. It's not that bad, but during daytime, it's just tacky. Anyways, these jeans, they fit so much better now that I stopped nursing. Like, I feel like I got like more curves and like, you know, like it just fits better. It, they felt really loose before. Now they feel really good and comfortable. My shirt is from Zara. I decided to tie it towards the front just to give, make it more, a bit more like interesting. And my necklace is my Haiti necklace from SB Jewelry. And I forgot the brand, but the same necklace with my son's initials. I'm wearing my Cartier Dope from SB Jewelry collection. I'm also wearing my engagement ring as well as, um, uh, rings from Shein. My watch is my two-tone JBW watch because I'm wearing my Fendi and my Fendi is two-tone. So I figured I'd do a two-tone moment today. I did my natural makeup because I am sporting a bun. I wanted to do a long braid and I tried doing it myself and I'm the type of person like if it doesn't work on the spot, it won't work at all. So I was like, let me not waste time with this braid and just do a bun. You've been looking cute with your five head all week so you're good just do a bun okay do a bun um i didn't feel i don't like when it starts getting warm wigs are just like a no i'm not wearing a wig i will not wear a wig until november 2020 2023 um these earrings are also from shein they're like i, I was wearing the smaller version today but i decided to wear the bigger ones just to I like this. This is nice. Um, fragrance. It's warmer. It's not that warm. Tomorrow is 23 degrees. Mother Nature. What's going on? Oh, I need to put deodorant on. I feel like you guys watch me put on deodorant, like, way too often. Like, this is not, like, what kind of channel is this? If anybody's into that, make sure you PayPal me, because this is weird. You, you guys see me put on deodorant often. If any man is into that and you want to send me money <laughs> i'm kidding not really what freak it's getting it's nice out like what do i wear what do i wear um let's keep it simple burberry her period burberry her burberry her obviously i'm gonna douse myself in this do you guys want to know one of my biggest fears in life like something that i think about way too much smelling bad Everybody tells me, Darcia, you smell amazing. You always smell good. I remember when I worked at the barber shop, the bar there was like a couple barbers that were like, Ooh, you smell nice all the time. You always smell good. I was like, period. There's something about smelling bad that just like, like freaks me out. Like, oh, I don't know what it is. Anyways, I'm wearing my Fendi because I wanted a bag big enough to carry a book. <laughs> and I'm not joking. I have a book in here. Um, I just... I don't know, just in case like I get there too early and I wait in the car or something. I just want something that's like not my phone. Um, I And yeah, I'm wearing my Fendi that's two-toned. There's like gold, silvers and whatever. So it matches with this. And I don't know what coat I'm gonna wear. I think it's gonna be the cardigan coat from Zara. What, they're, they're coat again, the coat again from Zara. Cause it's just giving like spring vibes. You know, I need a new one cause that one's really dirty, but I gotta go. I feel like I'm procrastinating. I am vlogging, so I'm taking you guys with me. When I'm in the house, when I'm in the house, I use this big ass camera because it just it's better quality and I'm really tight on budget right now when it comes to like because I'm getting married. I could, you know, go in my savings and just pull out a thousand dollars and buy a vlogging camera, but I'm like, mm, no. <laughs> Not now. Um but yeah, anyways. Here's a full fit. I know the camera's massive, but it's still cute. Um I think I look pretty. Even though I'm slightly insecure about my five head, um, I still feel really feminine and really pretty and put together. 
I am the jeans they fit really well the shirt as well like I just wanted something like comfortable but still put together um, the shoes are my go-to shoes like my fashion over heels they just go with everything and my toes they're not that bad because I did them myself but they're not cute enough for me to like they're still looking winter they still look like winter toes so yeah anyways here's my face I did my everyday makeup just simple with a bun I think the earrings really tied the look together like I feel really really pretty <laughs> anyways I'll see you guys over there having like a similar sense of humor it's it's lit i met tons of tons of subscribers as well that are like content creators that's what i loved it's because they were like big influencers and they were like micro influencers as well so i love that um it was a great event it was an amazing event i loved it anyways i got some gifts i got a pretty bag <laughs> and um they were making these custom bottles that you can put like products in it i don't know what i'm gonna put in it maybe oh you can put your shea moisture products but i don't know i think it's so pretty like i don't know what i can my toner maybe i don't know i don't know what i can put in this but i'm gonna keep it obviously but it's really cute then i got this um shea moisture coconut hibiscus curl enhancing smoothie my brother loves this so i'm happy i got this and it smells so good Yum. then i got this the deep moisturizing detangler which is great after washing my hair then they have two new gels because apparently people have been harassing them like hey we want gels we want gels and they're finally out with gels so they have two different types they have the coconut hibiscus with 
flaxseed. This has protein in it, thick curly hair. I think this is more for me because I have a lot of hair. Um, every person that's done a silk press, braided my hair, done anything to my hair, they're like, you have so much hair. Even my lash tech, she's like, you have so many lashes. Like, a classic set takes forever because I have so many lashes. So even like my head is full of hair. So I think this is gonna be good for me. And this one is hold control. So this is mainly, oh, black, uh, Jamaican black castor oil. I love Jamaican black castor oil. But, um, oh, it's closed. I don't want to open it for no reason. This is like strong hold. So whatever you want to, your hair like me, this is great for that. So I'm really happy I got that. Then we got these. What are these? Are these stickers? There were so many people, guys. I couldn't get everything. But there was this like mural and there was her art on it, which was great. But what are these? Are these stickers? I think they are. Oh, my God. Cute. There are these cute shea moisture stickers and there's like the products there's ingredients and there's these beautiful girls and there was these two girls that i met um i don't know their names but they had braids like i think some of, one of them had goddess braids another one had like twist or something and there were people doing hair and they put like these char like charms and like you know the little gold bands that you can but they put them like all over their hair and it looked beautiful. They looked like goddesses. They looked so pretty. And yeah, we were talking about cameras and stuff. But yeah, it was a really, really fun event. And look at my, this is like my storage closet where my cat's litter is and forget about this. But um, yeah, I met so many people that I follow or that follow me and I didn't know. And yeah, it was a great, great event. I don't know if this is the end of the vlog. I doubt it because we're seeing Christelle tomorrow. My fucking gym. Plim gym. Anyways, I have to go take my makeup off, shower, and read. That's what I'm gonna do tonight. By Ben, Rite, Makiyash Sufigim, Ben, Felix Tu. It's a slaughter gang CEO. I got dick for you if I'm not working, girl. If I'm busy, then fuck no. You need to find you someone else to call when your bank account get low. You need to find you someone. You give me so high. 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 Oh, you. Oh. Good morning. We are heading out. To go see Christelle. You guys are always too low for my like vanity perfume station, whatever. But I'm wearing my outfit from uh, Revolve. It's from Being Well, Well Being, whatever. And it's linked in my last vlog, but I will link it in this vlog as well. I'm wearing this cropped denim jacket from Zara, I think. Zara or Forever 21, but Zara has it every year, so yeah. I'm wearing my Michael Kors watch. Shein rings mixed with my, this ring that Bay got me for Christmas. An engagement ring. And Shein earrings. Bag is my Prada re-edition. Shoes are Air Force Ones. Socks are my Amazon stack socks. And yeah, this giving bbl <laughs> i'm kidding um today's fragrance is gonna be something simple i like this during the springtime my i used to be best friends with this girl and she put me onto this we were like early 20s at the time and i've been obsessed ever since um it's a great spring scent it just does its thing it just doesn't last that's the only thing i don't like it's number two by ralph lauren and i think here in montreal you can get it at the bay but like not at Sephora. And if you can get it at Sephora, I think it's online. So yeah, I wish I had a smaller version of this. I think I got this at the L'Oreal sale, if I remember correctly. Anyways, I have to go because I really want to drop Attila a bit earlier because I have a lash appointment. And um, oh yeah, sunglasses are my Valenciagas from Amazon. I want to drop off Attila because I want to pick up a coffee for me and Christelle. So hopefully I have time to do that. And yeah, let's head out. <laughs> I have a bad habit of putting my bags on the floor. Don't come for me. <laughs> oh, and let me bring a hoodie. 
in case it gets cold. Bonjour, um, est-ce que je peux avoir un medium caramel macchiato iced? Parfait, uh, Cali style, s'il te plaît. Um, Est-ce que je peux avoir un, aussi un medium vanilla latte iced as well? Medium iced vanilla latte, anything else? Um, that'll be it. Okay, thank you. They are not as friendly as my area. Side eye. <laughs> Bombastic side eye. It's like nice out and it's like pretty warm. It's 14 degrees Celsius. But like, you know, it still smells like winter. It smells like outside, like the crisp. I don't like that. Oh, there's a pink truck. Pull out the pink Lamborghini just to race with China. But the race with China just to race with China. Little bad Trini bitch. But she makes China real thick for China. Smoke the bricks to China. I tell all my niggas, cut the check. Bust it down. Hi. Hi. It's on debit. All right. I'm just, can I scan this For first? Sure. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Have a good day. It was nice. The girl at the mic thing wasn't as nice. Hello, hello, hello. You're so cute. <laughs> oh, I got none of them more shame. <laughs> Not me matching the aesthetic. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, we just made it. Here's the before. And I'll show you guys the after. Obviously, I don't have my eyes open, so I can't really show you guys. But yeah, we just made it to Crystal K Aesthetic, period. You guys know already, so I don't know why I'm acting like this is new information. Mais ça fait un an, là. Où ça fait un an? Je pense ça fait un an. Ça fait un an. I think it was last April. Oh what? my god. A one full year collaboration. That's crazy. <laughs> We're like friends now. We're like. <laughs> I got my lashes on yesterday. I didn't even show you guys. But here is how they look. So pretty and fluffy. Eee. I love my lash deck. She's so good. Anyways, shout out Kistel. Um, This morning we dropped off Itala. Bay has off today and he's getting his hair done. We don't know what's going on. He's getting like a perm. But like a curly perm. But not like Jerry Curls, you know? Like... Like a slight wave, like a cute, I think, hopefully, I don't know. I'm. He's in the in-between stage with his hair and it's getting warmer and he's been wearing a beanie all winter at work. He's allowed to at work and he's been wearing a beanie. He's like, it's too hot now, so I need to figure something out with my hair. So he's like, let me get a perm, let me get a haircut and see how it looks. Like a slight wave. I know when his hair is longer, it has, like when his hair was up to his back, it had a slight wave. So we know that that's his natural care curl pattern once it like i don't know maybe with time i don't know what happened with it growing out it had like a slight bounce to it now it's like slick straight it has no volume nothing it's just bowl cut we don't know what's going on so he's like let me figure something out get a haircut and then we'll see not wait we'll see anyways um we have a baby shower to attend to tomorrow so i figured i'd show you guys what i got the baby and what we're going to um i'm going to be doing like a cute little basket i love doing those they're so fun so yeah i got i went to the dollar store and picked up this pink shiny and soft shampoo with there's like a princess on it because she is having a girl and i picked up this live clean baby tearless baby bath um i should could have went to walmart or something but i didn't have time because Bay has his appointment like he's actually late for his appointment then we went to Costco and I picked up some strawberries. Where are they? Momo's literally like right in front of you guys. Um, I picked up some strawberries at Costco, so I'm gonna make myself oatmeal. Then I picked her up this cute pair of PJs. Um, you guys know the Peckle brand. If you've been following me since I had my son, like being a mom, whatever, um, we love Peckle because they have the double-sided zipper. If you're a new mom or you're about to be a new mom, let me fix you guys a bit if you're a new mom and you're about to or you're about to be a new mom the best pajamas are the ones with the double zippers so when you change the poopy diaper you don't have to take off the whole pajama off you just zip it up here so i always get them for people that have babies and stuff i just love them so much so 
this one has croissants and like waffles and toast and eggs on it so super cute then i found this one that has little doves or gooses very on brand for montreal on it with this little flower i love the color i also love their designs they have the best designs for like they just don't look tacky i just really like their designs then i have these popcorns so cute jimmy chose that one he really liked that one he jimmy wants a girl so bad oh my god <laughs> And then I got her this one with the smiley faces. I would have loved this one for Attila as well. Very cute. Attila absolutely despises onesies now. Like every time I put on a onesie, he's like, eh, eh, eh. It's like his, he hates them. Anyways, at the dollar store as well, I got these Philips binkies. These are for nighttime and they glow in the dark. I don't know who if you're planning on losing your baby at night i think it's just it's dark it's easier to see maybe if you want to like see you know when you're like paranoid when you have a kid so you're always checking if it's breathing you could see like i don't know but it's cute glow in the dark my son hated binkies so i never experienced that then i also found um just so you know i don't want you guys to think like i'm some cheap bitch that like shops at the dollar store it's just that you find name brands at the in Canada. Our dollar stores isn't are not like they're not like um why are you here? They're not like like a, a dollar store. It's it goes up to five dollars. And it's all things that you can find at Target, at Walmart, um, whatever. So I found this. These are just like little things that you can put your straps. They just like help. You can switch them out. They come your your car seat comes with them and they're like black. But you can switch them out so there's like these pink ones so i got that for her i added that and i have extra things let's see what i can find okay so in my son's stash i found the matching lotion pink right um i found these teething medicine um two it's a pack of two i get them on amazon they're brand new so yeah and i also got flowers but i just realized that i don't know if i can cut these with scissors i hope i can and they're just to like add to the basket just to like i don't know we'll see if i can make it look cute um this is a basket i got it's too small i told jimmy this is not gonna fit everything and he's like it will and i'm like no so i don't have an extra like bigger basket that i can like you know swap i really don't so i don't know what i'm gonna do i think that's not that's not the aesthetic i was going for i think this will have to do i got this a long time ago it's been sitting in until his room it still has this thing on it so it's new and i think i'm just gonna put everything in here the aesthetic i wanted was like wood like a wooden feel this man does not listen to me ever Hey guys, we are about to leave. Bay's back and he got his hair done. We don't know how we feel about it. We, it's not that it looks uh, bad. Can we take off the hat? And yeah, show them. <laughs> he has so much hair. It looks we, good on the camera. Bro, no, no, don't. <laughs> Um, oh, you're cute. It looks good with the hat, especially. But we are about wow. to go pick up Attila. I just got done uh, filming content. He brought me food. He brought me um, like sautéed vegetables. You guys can't really see, but 
it was yummy. I ate. Anyways, this is messy. Let me show you guys. He brought me sauteed vegetables. I don't know. It's not Chinese broccoli, but it like kind of is with shrimp fried rice. But the only disappointing thing is that they put like three shrimps in here. So is is this shrimp fried rice really? Because it's giving like... Absolutely not. Oh my God. Damn, he's a hater. <laughs> he put like... Sunglasses? Wait, why is it blurry? Look, he's just messing with me at this point. What? Why are you wearing your hat like this? It looks nice. No. Jimmy. This guy. Um, We have to go to Sephora. Is a Sephora sale? I don't know why this is blurry. But it's a Sephora sale and I'm really excited. So we're going to go to Sephora. The mirror is in the living room because I was filming content. So after... What is it, baby? But you already have treats. You already got treats today. Mm. I'm kidding. <laughs> I am kidding. Uh, oh, you need water though. I'm gonna get you water. Guys, we got the goods. There were way too many people at Sephora for me to film. But yeah, I got uh, two of them because, you know, this is crack, okay? I'm being honest with you guys. I love these so much. It's the best serum out there. Oh, I'm so happy. It's just Montreal roads are honestly the worst. But we are on our way to buy some books. <laughs> when I say that like that, we're on our way to buy some books. Um, this girl on Virage Sale is selling terms of con ter terms and conditions, and the the other one. The print, the pr no, not the fine print. That's the third one. She's not selling that one. The other one, the second one, and um, the Zodiac Academy for eight dollars each. And y'all know how these books be twenty five ninety nine plus tax in Canada, and tax is fifteen percent by the way. Just if you guys don't know, in Montreal, Quebec, les taxes là, they're kicking our asses. We are, we honestly, our lives are ninety nine point nine nine percent tax and snow. <laughs> but um, it's a really nice pretty April spring day it's giving spring like tulips I want to see tulips everywhere flowers everybody every I don't know people on the road they seem to be in a good mood it's giving so I'm buying books then I'm going to indigo why because TikTok, the book the nanny is everywhere on my for you page so um, summary quick summary of the book there's another word for that I forgot but quick summary of the book basically this girl that has an only fans I don't know what's going on with her only fans but it's not giving okay her only fans not giving um, whatever I don't know what's going on with only fans but she can't she, she has to like find another source of income um, so she becomes a nanny to this single dad turns out she finds out that the single dad was her biggest watcher on only fans what what <laughs> when I say I like drama, this is the type of drama I like. Like, I want to know. I want to know why. You know, I want to know. As a content creator, this is funny to me. And I'm not. I'm not on OnlyFans. I'm not an OF. Uh, I'm just saying as a. It's just funny to me. Like what? So it's on. It's on sale for twenty bucks at Indigo. The thing is that lately Indigo has been like giving me problems. Like they said last time I went there for um, Twisted Hate, they said that uh, they should have fixed it within a week and haven't been to Indigo in like two weeks, which is good. Because ever since I started reading again, um, I've been at Indigo like almost like every week. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna go pick up those books at that girl's job uh, and Yeah, and then what else are we doing today? I'm gonna stop by Marshall's of course It's just a what, what are you doing sir? I'm gonna stop by Qua? Yeah, we're gonna stop by Marshall's of course because it's near Indigo and I cannot live without Marshall's It's just it's just it's honestly like let's talk about this epidemic here crack pipe anything winners and marshals I don't like the fact that this is shaking so much but it's the roads like it's not even the tripod the tripod is very sturdy it's like 
Montreal roads feel I feel like I'm on the moon you know how like they say that the moon is like rocks and just like yo this truck man en plus j'ai un petit bois allez là comme t'es là à prendre ton temps là comme yo t'es un camion it's not even a big truck t'es un petit camion anyways I'm not gonna film this this innocent lady imagine I'm gonna tell you that I'm here I got the goods and they're in such good condition guys they're like brand new I was like sis do you she's like they're red but they're in good con and she sold them to me for eight dollars each and I also got the Zodiac Academy I heard great things about this it's just that the series is entirely too long so I'm gonna read the first one I got it for a good price and if I like it then I'll keep buying the series but I already have Ice Planet Barbarians that I really want to read so I'm like and that's a long series, so I'm kind of like, eh, like, why do I keep starting these series? Anyways, the third one is the fine print, so I'm gonna, I don't mind buying, um, it's from the Dreamland Billionaire series. We love a good billionaire. If I buy the third one for regular price, I don't mind, because I got these, I got three books for 25, for $24. Anyways, let's go to Indigo to get the nanny, and then go to Marshalls. <laughs> Guys, I get so giddy when I come here. Oh my god, like a kid in a candy store. Okay, so we have the um, TikTok section. Oh, they don't have music on today. Apparently, this is really good. Maybe it's in new releases. This is not a new release. Why are you lying? I want chapter one of this. I can't seem to find it anywhere. Apparently this is good too. Uh, let's see. Ooh, icebreakers. Oh, I have it. <laughs> Wait, do I have it? Do I have icebreaker? I need to check, but this is a good price. Um, apparently, apparently the Uber scene is wild. <gasps> there it is. What I came here for. Yay. But a lot of these are like on sale. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I need to check if I have icebreaker. I have a few. Do I have icebreaker? I need to check. You guys, I'm shook. I did not know they had these here. Oh my god. This was so good. Do I order on Amazon? Honestly, I just bought like three book, four books now, so I'm not buying. No, let me let me get my shit together first. <laughs> Let's go see if there's something interesting for my son. Not that he cares about books. He usually attempts to rip the pages off. This is cute. Oh, cause it's Mother's Day. I'm like, why are they all related to mothers? <laughs> Mother's Day is coming up. Oh, moms. Oh, this is cute. Bluey. He loves Bluey. I love... This is a... How pretty are these? This as well. What a pretty book. Almost mommy day. I like this. The thing with my son is that he doesn't show interest to much. Um, besides breaking my things. <laughs> Oh, I shouldn't be laughing. Besides breaking my things, he doesn't really show interest in much, so. <laughs> oh, my camera's about to die. No, I, I have another battery in my, my bag, but I got stuff. Um, I got this book for Attila called Blinky and the Phone Fiasco. It was on sale for $2, so I was like, I love adding books to his. Um library i also got him this called black and white and it's two pandas and it says one panda is black and white and another one is white and black and uh they're basically like enemies like they have nothing in common they don't get along and they probably like figure out at the end i thought it was such an aesthetically pleasing book and it matches my outfit period <laughs> then i got this because we're going to a baby shower again and i'm doing another basket 
and I found this. I'm gonna add books as well for her. Um, and it's a girl, so I found these like holders, like they're like to like press them together. I'm looking for cute ones for me for as an adult. I can't seem to find any that I like, but yeah, I got this, and it was also for five dollars. So to add to her basket with the books, and I got what I actually came in for so i don't know if i'm gonna start this right now because i'm reading a book a fantasy book right now i think it's a monster romance if i'm being honest and yeah so um i'm gonna put everything in here i'm gonna go to marshall's i'm gonna call film because i'm always filming in marshall's but my, my camera's dying so um let me put all of the books in here it's this is a big haul <laughs> i did not expect to spend this much on books I'm home. I'm home. Look, Lemon. Guess it all. Um, you guys saw the books that I got. Uh, let me get a thumbnail. Wait, we have to show that it's indigo. You can't, you have to be on this side. Okay, um, you guys saw what I got, but I did um, go to Marshall's and then I went to another Winners on the way home and I found my, I got my solar water. That's all I got. <laughs> That's all I got because I ran out and I was using toner. For the past like two, three days, I've been using toner to take my makeup off. Is that, that's crazy. Li my face is melting off at this point. Acid. <laughs> my skin. Um, I'm excited for these books. Oh, this is the book I'm reading by Viano Oniomo. It's a monster romance. I like all kinds of romance books. Like, I, as long as long as there's like at least a bit of spice, and you know, I can I can work with with these books. Like, I don't care. Also, review this book. This book. It's so good. It's, I don't know how to, like I wanna give a resume but I wanna give too much away. Anyways, this girl, marriage of convenience, enemies to lovers, but unrequited, what? Requited, unrequited love. So one of them falls in love first, of course. And um, it's not, for, I don't know how to explain it. Like, it's a bit complicated. Um, it's, there's a plot twist. I'm really excited. I'm really excited about it. it was a Mina Ramsey. Is that her name? Yes. I think this is her first book. This was a really good book. It was I ate this shit up. Like it was really good. It, at first, it's really slow burn. So it takes a while for them to like, you know, but like it's so good. Like, oh my. God. Guys, Jimmy just said something so cute i'm gonna cry oh my god i love this guy man he said we can get another cat after the wedding why am i crying i'm because he really wants another baby and i'm not ready yet and he like respects that but i'm like i like we could get like another pet and he wasn't down at first and now he just like randomly texted me that and I'm like because I have like I want to get after the wedding I have like things I want to do before having another kid like you know we want to buy a house but the house market is like trash so like it's just why am I being so I'm gonna get my it's obvious I'm getting my period I'm so emotional that's so random anyways this book I almost cried reading this book I think I'm gonna have my period um towards the end all of like the tea was like it was bombarding me with like like smut fluff zinc, like tea like just a bunch of like the the last like four chapters i was just like overwhelmed but it was so good it's like eh. anyways it was it's a good book so it's on amazon i'll link it for you guys it's so good she has a cat the main character has a cat i have a cat my man just said something and i'm like flustered like i'm discombobulated is that a word like i'm just extremely i'm like sweating anyways i have stuff to do i have a video that i need to fix um for a brand um i need to film it the wig curly so i'm not gonna put the wig forever i'm just gonna glue this part on 
film the bits and pieces and then add it to the video because I'm not doing a whole install. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just, but I don't know why Jimmy saying that to me really put me into like this thing, but um, yeah, anyways, that was a really, really good book. Also, I don't know if I told you guys this book. I, I don't know if I told you guys, but I was reading this book not too long ago. What's his name again? Arcane. King Arcane. The fluff, the spice. It's a good book. Look, oh, they're so cute. I was kicking my feet. This is a good book. <sighs> At this point, like, I'm reading so many books, like, back to back to back. I should probably just uh, invest in a Kindle. But knowing me, I like having the physical copy. Like, I like not being on my phone or being like on the screen i'm always on a screen so i'm really happy that i like the like i like the physical copy i prefer that so um i have work to do i'll see you guys later um i have to pack up some things because i'm selling tons of clothes these are like bags full of clothes that i'm selling i sold all of this to a girl and i sold different like all of their names are on this um, I am sick and tired of being overwhelmed with clothing. Um, I'm really picky now with my try on hauls. I don't do try on hauls every single brand that contacts me anymore or whatever. Like I, I like trying stuff out for you guys, but I'm, I'm just, I have too much clothes. So if you guys want to buy stuff off of me, um, very cheap. Um, so yeah, so I have to pack up some stuff, um, film the end of that video, edit some stuff, and yeah, I'll see you guys afterwards. I didn't even film yet. The maintenance guy just left because the transitions over here were lifted. They, they were gone. Attila thought, you know, it's a lightsaber or something. He kept picking it up. I would find the piece in my room. So he fixed here and he fixed over here. I have to leave these for 24 hours. And then we're good. Editing Darcia here. I just wanted to say thank you for watching this video. I just realized that I never closed off this vlog now that I'm editing it. And this is like a two week old vlog. So I'm just coming and I got my hair ripped. Like so much happened. So um, yeah, thanks for watching. I love you guys so much. And make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Mwah.